Hi guys, so I'm coming back with another plan with me. I'm actually pretty excited because it's only Tuesday and I'm already filming this. I'm trying to get ahead. Um, that's always a good idea for me because then I forget to edit and then I'm right on time and then I don't know. I just always want to be ahead and I've been doing a really bad job at it lately. But this is for October the 8th through the 14th. So today is the 2nd and... For this week, I'm going to be using this cute printable from um, Planner One Love. And she, you guys, is amazing. So she gives you a lot. So it's two full sheets, as you can tell. And it has everything you need. I mean, it's... She does a really, really good job. Um, I mean, there's a couple of stickers on here that... I don't know. Maybe you're missing. I don't... I don't really see them, but I don't know. Um, she gives you a lot, especially for free. These are absolutely free. She does have some that cost money as well, so definitely go check her out. It's at um, planneronelove.com. She does an amazing job, and I am hot. Um, I actually went to Walmart today to go grocery shopping, and... I got really faint and had to like call my husband. He live he work he lives. Yeah, pretty much. He works across the street from the Walmart I went to. And he came over there and like rescued me because I was about to pass out. And it was not fun. I had to like sit in the aisle and it was so awkward. Everybody was staring at me. It was horrible, but I had to do it because I was about to pass out. Like it was really bad. I think I just got a little dehydrated and I don't know. I, and hot in there, I guess. I don't know. It's just not good. I think I got a little overheated and then I just got like dehydrated. I hadn't drank enough water and I was drinking Starbucks. I got a Starbucks and I should have not, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, I am feeling a little bit better now, but I had to come in and like put all the groceries away because my husband like helped me get the rest of the groceries and then load them in the car. But I just went ahead and came home on my own and he went back to work. <clears throat> I told him that it was okay that he could go back to work. Um, now I don't know where my blade is and that is just not a good thing. I have no idea where my blade is, which is bad in general because it's an actual box cutter blade and that's not good when I have nosy little people around who always want my things. It could really hurt him. Here it is. It just fell. That's all. Okay. <clears throat> I didn't cut the bottom of this. And I might have to stop in the middle of this and like charge my battery or, and empty it because my phone is being so odd. It was at 100% when I left this morning and that wasn't even that long ago and it's already at like 40%. So it was doing weird things and updating and shutting itself off and being ridiculous. So I don't know what's up with that. But oh well. So, I'm like burning up right now, and I turned the fan on, but it was really loud, and it was blowing my hair everywhere, and it was annoying me, so I turned it back off, but I don't know, it's hot. Okay, so, I am going to start with my washi, and then I'm going to do a washi banner, I think, and then I want to do, um... What else do I want to do? And then I'll get started with my full boxes. So I'm going to do that really quickly and then I'll be right back.
Okay, so I think we're good to go for now. Okay, so I am going to, I do want to put down some washi. Unfortunately, um, the washi that I'm using this week is really transparent, like all of it except for this candy corn. And candy corn is really not my biggest priority as far, as far as what will look good this week. So I do have some white out that I just bought. I finally bought some more, but it is in the other room. So I'll have to go get it if I need to white anything out. But I'm going to try to avoid it if I can. Okay, so I am going to put a this week header. It's really cute. And I know I have some of that. That's what I need to get. I need to grab that washi. Okay, I grabbed this too because that will help. I have other Halloween washi too. I wish I had some purple, but I don't. Okay, so I do want to use some of this film washi. I think it's so cute. And this is a movie, so it is mildly appropriate. I am going to put down my weekly box and let's see there's a hydrate sticker as well and I want to use that one because I'm obviously not drinking enough water. Water is, it, drinking enough is so hard for me during pregnancy. Like that's one of the hardest things. Like I eat okay and I like don't eat the wrong things like all of the no-no's that you're supposed to stay away from and I do pretty well with caffeine like I only have either like one coffee a day or soda not both I I do pretty well with that I'm gonna put down a couple of trackers I'm not positive what I'm gonna use them for yet but I think I want it what do I want I want this spider web one, but I like that purple too. Um, but um, I had, I do terribly with water intake, and that's like one of the most important things you can possibly do. And it's because I don't drink a lot. I just don't drink a lot. Um, with dinner, I don't drink a lot. Like during the day, I don't. I'm not thirsty. Like I just don't drink a lot. Now, of course, I get thirstier when I'm pregnant, but not enough, <laughs> apparently. So, yeah, it's a problem. Okay, so I do want to use some of these, and I think I'm going to use these across the top of all of the boxes. So let's see how these fit. I know they're not going to fit perfectly because this is not, it, see it says the Erin Condren Recollections Planner. It's not made for the happy planner so it's not perfection but I honestly don't have a problem with it enough for it to bother me. Like it's fine. It fits well enough that it doesn't bug me. Which, honestly, to be completely honest, I'm really not that picky when it comes to stuff like that. Some people are with their planners, and their planners are beautiful, and more power to them, but I just don't, I don't care about all the little bitty details enough for it to matter. Because I just, I just don't. <laughs> I just don't. I have, I'm, I'm just not, if I were a perfectionist, this would take me hours because I'm just clumsy and I make too many mistakes and I can't get anything straight because I, I shake a lot and things like that. Like I would just, it would take me so long if I was a perfectionist. So I'm not, <laughs> that's why I love to craft and do like junk journals and things like that because it is a mess and that's what makes it beautiful like you use all kind of scraps and things and put things together like that and that's what makes it pretty so yeah all right so I am going to use a to-do sticker for um, 
think I'm going to use this color for Monday. Because Monday is when I do like a lot of cleaning to do's and things inside the house. And so, I, and I think I'm going to use some washing in between there. Um, it's when I do like a lot of cleaning. And so, put that there. Okay, so let's make sure I'm kind of in frame at least, and then I want to put some more washi. I don't really want to use the pumpkin because I don't want any more of that orange. And use a full box. So if you guys don't know, and I didn't even use a full box at the top. But I definitely want to. So you can kind of still see the October, so I think I'll move it down just a little bit so you can see it. I love this movie, and I don't know, it's really actually pretty creepy. So I really, honestly, to be honest with you, I don't know how I was allowed to watch this when I was younger because my parents were extremely strict. And when I say extremely strict, I mean like sheltered to the max, like ridiculous. I'm not going to lie, like completely ridiculous about everything. Like I didn't go on my first date until I was 18. The rule was that I was supposed to wait until I was 16, but then when I was 16, um, they didn't like my boyfriend, so I wasn't allowed to date him or go anywhere with him. Like, how ridiculous is that? They were, like, really strict on me, and... Like, I wasn't allowed. Like, I got my Harry Potter books taken away because my mom thought they were, like, I don't know, evil. And, yeah. It was very stereotypical preacher's kid household. And then when my brother and sister got older, it was complete opposite. Like, they were allowed to do so many things that I was absolutely not. And so it was so annoying. <laughs> I would get so mad and frustrated because... They were allowed to do so much more than I was, for sure. I don't think I want to use her yet. I want to use the moon. Yeah, but that's how it works. Like, the oldest is always the one that has to, like, go through the most. And you're harder on the first one. I think it's a little bit different because... It was worse for me because my parents had me so young. Like, they were 16 and 19 when I was born. And so they were so strict on me. And then um, my brother and sister are twins. And they are... Um, they are um, seven years apart from me. Like, I'm seven years older than they are. So, I mean, you know, my parents had already, like, halfway raised me by the time they got old enough to do anything. So, I think that it was just one of those things where I just got more lenient as the days went on, as the years went by, you know. And they were just lucky that way. They probably don't see it like that, I'm sure, but it was totally like that. So I'm really not even sure how I got to be able to watch this movie, because it is, like, really creepy. It's Tim Burton, so you know it's creeps, but I love this movie. I've always loved it. And when I was a teenager, I was probably about 14 or 15, and Joshua was... So if I was 14, then he was 11... 
almost 12, and he, God, I can't believe he was that young. I might have been 15, so he was probably like 12, almost 13, or something like that, but he drew me a picture of Jack Skellington, and I still have it. <laughs> so, it's really cute, and it reminds me of that. Okay, I want to use this dinner sticker for sure, so I'm going to put that at the bottom and kind of work from there. I wish I had more half boxes. I'm not going to have enough. So I might not use any half boxes on the weekend. So I might do it that way. But yeah, it reminds me of when we were kids because he had the biggest crush on me and he just chased after me for years and years and I would not I mean he was a lot younger than me you know so I would not give him the time of day and he just never gave up and here we are so apparently it paid off because it worked eventually and we both got married to different people, and they didn't work out, and we both got together, and then here we are. We're almost three kids later, so it must have worked, at least somehow. Okay, I'm going to use a quarter box here, because this is Joshua's date off. If I can get the quarter box off. This is his day off, probably. I really prefer him to have Tuesdays off, but it's easier for him to take Wednesdays off, and I don't like it <laughs> because Wednesday is church day, so it just kind of cuts our day off, and yeah, it's just not fun to drive an hour to church and an hour back like it just takes up a lot of our family time and I hate it so I really prefer him to have Tuesdays off but he just can't do that sometimes okay so I don't know what we'll be doing that day but I do again want to use my dinner sticker and my half box So for sure he's taken off um, Wednesday this week, like tomorrow is his off day, and I hate it. <laughs> I wish it wasn't. And it, it sucks too, especially now that Tristan's in school, because um, Tristan doesn't really get to see him very much, because he gets out of school, and then we have to get ready and go to church, so we really don't get to spend that much time with him. So, that kind of sucks. I hate that. But, there's not much you can do about it. It just kind of is what it is. It gets a little bit harder to kind of maneuver things around when you um, have a kid in school and you have a busy schedule. So, yep. And then we have church, so I'll put that down. And I cut that crooked, so I don't mind that it's like covering it up. So I've cut it crooked. Okay, moving on to Thursday. So Thursday is kind of a just whatever goes kind of day like it's not I don't I clean on Thursday but it's not like my major cleaning day and I don't really ever run errands on Thursday things like that it's just kind of a whatever happens happens day so I'm just going to use let's see this purple little box checklist and we'll just kind of see what we can get done and then I'm going to use um, full box and it cut off for me. 
think I'm going to take a rest and empty this out and charge my... Okay, you guys, so I'm not even going to lie to you and tell you that it has not been over a week since I started this. So I have done the first half of the week and I just got so busy and things were so crazy. And they're st honestly still crazy because I'm probably going to have interruptions. Joshua is outside playing with some of his, like a couple of his friends are over here. Um, our neighbor is over here and... Um, the boys are outside playing, but Killian doesn't play cornhole, so <laughs> he's probably going to come in here and interrupt about 50 times, and I just heard him fall and Joshua say, go tell your mama about it. So I know that he is telling him to come in here, so, and so you'll probably hear them anyways, and that's, see, you can totally hear them, like yelling. So, yes, how rude. But I still needed to finish this. I'm really behind, and I don't want to be behind. Oh, I, was, I forgot what I had been doing because it's been so long. I forgot I was putting my meal sticker to kind of keep up with what um, we had for dinner for the week. And then I wanted to put a half box down for, like, whatever happens in the evening time after Joshua gets home. That's fun to do. Oh, bless me. So, I have been, it's been crazy because we actually haven't been home a lot this week. I was gone all the week during the week and on Saturday, and then we've been gone all day today. It was homecoming today at church, so we were there for that, and then after that we went to a couple of different shops and things to kind of get some errands done and looked around at some stuff and just had a good time, but... It still made it really busy, and for some reason, I have like a buttload of full boxes, and I just realized I didn't even use a full box on Wednesday. I have no idea why, but I didn't, and so, yeah, but, yeah, and so I'm going to use them. <laughs> So this week is Tristan's off week from school. He's off for fall break. And um, so that'll be fun, I hope. I hope the boys don't fight a lot because they fight all the time. They are the sweetest, sweetest little ones when they um, are getting along. But buddy, they fight all the time. And it drives me bonkers and I'm sorry they're so loud out there they are really loud and I'm sorry but honestly if I don't have no time it's really film time for me and so when I have a bunch of babysitters out there I'm gonna use it like oh you boys are gonna watch the boys okay good goodbye and there you go like I'm I need some time to film and um he was telling me like he was ready to come home and I wanted to go to a couple more places and he was like, if you want to go, then you totally can just leave the boys with me and go. And I was like, um, I, um, will film. Somehow this is not the same. <laughs> I don't really know why. I think I didn't put it down as low. Wow, they're so loud. So loud. There's, I'm literally outnumbered so badly, you guys. I love you, sweet baby. I'm so outnumbered by all of these boys and males that hang out around here. And I think they like, I don't know. They're all young, and I'm the oldest, too, so <laughs> I mean, my husband's 28, so I'm, um, uh-oh, here he comes, something happened. Okay, so I'm probably going to kill my husband because, number one, he didn't honor our deal with watching the kiddos while I film, and number two, because he sent Killian in here to me screaming and crying because he was being 
daddy was being mean to him, he said. And number two, he is being so stinging loud, getting on my last nerve. So he is not being a friendly, helpful husband today. So yeah, I'm not happy with him right now. Being a butt. So, anyways, I want to get this some stuff done, and I really want. Um, I'm going to put this on here, and this is our weekend with Jaren. I do know that is going on. I think I want this to be thinner. I kind of want it to be like, look at this. And these stickers are so cut crooked and it is all my fault. I definitely have to take credit for that because it is my fault for sure. But I didn't mean to. <laughs> They're cut crooked, but that's okay. I mean, most of the time I cover it up with another one on top of it. It looks much more straight, but I don't know. I do the best I can. <laughs> I've got some lots going on. Most of the time, somebody's like pulling at my arm while I'm trying to cut it. So, you know, it just kind of is what it is. So, I went to church today. I, I was saying like it was homecoming. It was like our church's 50 year anniversary where we've been <clears throat> a church for 50 years. And um, I'm trying to think because I'm not going to need a whole checklist for sure for Saturday and Sunday because it'll or especially for Sunday but I'm probably not Saturday either because it will be church day so I'm probably just going to I'm trying to decide if I want to do two full boxes on the weekend and just do two full boxes and but I don't know how I'm gonna like that so let's see if I put two full boxes and then some washi I'm thinking about it because I don't really have a lot of weekend plans anyway so I think what I might do is just cover this up and put this here and it will give me a little bit more room and then go from there but anyways I went to church the, today and like I was wearing like a form-fitted dress it was it's really pretty it's a Vera Wang dress it's like one of the only Vera Wang dresses that I actually like that's that pretty to me from Kohl's I just don't think that her line there is always the most flattering for my age group um she has some really cute stuff but I just don't think it's flattering for for me but this dress in particular is gorgeous and I love it so or maybe my style maybe not for my age group but for my style um, make sure you shut the door okay I love you baby so um, anyway <clears throat> I wore that it's like really f I said shut the door baby it's like really form fitting and so you could totally see my belly bump like a mile away and everybody was like oh my gosh like I can't tell you how many people said when are you do and I was like um the end of January and they were like are you kidding me are you sure it's not twins and that is just not a good thing like not the best of things to say to a six month pregnant woman you know what I mean like well, thanks, guys. That makes me feel so good that I look humongous and, you know, thanks a lot. I really appreciate that. I mean, really? Like, uh, I thought, well, okay then. I guess I look huge. Like, thanks a lot. But they didn't mean anything by it, for real. They were just saying because I do look big and it is, you know not that far along so I get it Tristan. okay now he's coming here interrupting me being loud what am I gonna do with him I don't know 
anyways, they didn't mean any harm by their, like, comments. They, I, I just obviously look, I mean, I do look, my belly is just very obvious and very out there. <laughs> and it gets bigger by the day, honestly, I feel like. But at the same time, it's like, what are you going to do? Okay, so I do have church and then I have small group on Sunday. So I want to mark both of those. But I I don't know. I might just go ahead and put this quarter box here too and not worry about the washi and just do it this way for Saturday. I don't know if Jaren has a game on Saturday. I'm sure he does. And I'm sure I'll have to take him to it. So that's kind of a bummer. Um, not trying to be mean, it's just that taking Killian and Tristan to a blazing hot football field and they don't have, um, they don't have, like, shade of any kind at all. Okay, then I'm going to just put some more of this washi down, I think, because I don't really have anything else going on for this day. And when I put that to-do list down, it's going to be more than enough. So I'm just going to use that. And I think I'll use like this one here. Just to put a little bit of brown in there with that black. Okay, this is really dark and twisty, but I like it. And I think I'm going to use, and I still have stickers left. So you see, I covered up everything, and I still have plenty of stickers left. So she gives you so much for free, and it's crazy to me. So I'm going to use the stripes because of Jack Skellington's suit. It just reminds me of him. And, of course, Killian opened the door wide, and someone turned on the dryer, which means it's loud, and I can hear it. you guys this is how I can get things done okay so I went ahead and put that on there and their food is here so he's fixing their plate at least he's doing that I'm mad at him for not being quiet being in cornhole mode instead of babysit mode like he was promising he was going to do. See, the deal was he went inside and got his hair cut in the middle of town, so we were stuck. And we were in the car, and they were cranky, and Killing was loud and crying and screaming about everything. Everything was a meltdown. They were fighting. And we stayed in there so stinking long. I was like, how can you have such a small amount of hair for, like, how do guys' haircuts take that long? But they did. So I'm going to pull some stickers for the week, and then I will be right back. Okay, so let's see what we've got going on. I have people coming in and out of here driving me bonkers. Okay, so on Monday, I do know that um, I will have to clean tomorrow. I'm just planning on doing nothing but cleaning. And I also know our power and water bill is due. And I don't have a power bill button that... Um, a button, a power bill sticker that it matches, but I do have that um, water sticker, and it's the same anyway, so it's fine. I do need to clean, and of course, this I'm just going to use this house sticker for cleaning because I need to clean the entire house. So, yeah, that's going to be for that. Um, so, I do need to do that. I am caught up on laundry, but I do need to fold it and put away, put it away. So I'm just going to put this um, iron sticker on here. And I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I definitely need to do. Um, I do need to give the boys a haircut at some point this week. So I'm going to put this down. I'm just going to put this down here. I know that that's not what that's for, but that's where I'm going to put it. Okay, so there's that. I want Joshua. He's supposed to change the oil in the car 
on Tuesday when he is off. So he's going to do an oil change on the car. On Wednesday, we have a church. So I'm going to put this prayer sticker down. He is not off on Wednesday. So that for the day off sticker is not, does not apply. But that's okay because he is off on, um, he is off on Tuesday instead. So there's that. Um, let's see, we have church on this day. And we also have small groups. So I'm going to put these stickers down here for that. And let us see. Oops, I dropped one. Um, he is out of school, so I'm going to stick this down there. I probably won't even use those as habit trackers. I will just use them as some whatever else for the week. I am going to put a coffee sticker down on Monday, and I'm also going to put a coffee sticker down on Thursday. Those are my favorite times to put them on here. And then this here says day off. We're not going to have, um, we're not going to have a, what am I trying to say? Oh, we're not going to have a date night this week because it is our, um, it is our weekend with Jaren and we don't have date nights on those weeks, which really kind of sucks, but it is what it is, so it's fine. Um, but Jaren probably does have a ball game on this day and I will have to take him to it, so I'm going to put that there. Um, I'm going to put family night down for Friday night because that's what we need to do. We need to have some kind of a movie or something. So I'm going to try and plan that out and kind of have that going. Let's see, I know I have a popcorn sticker in here somewhere. And so we will just have popcorn and a movie that night. Probably like a cute little kid Halloween movie, hopefully. And I'll bake some cookies or something like that and we can do that. Um, Tristan has a um, field trip coming up to the pumpkin patch. And he has some forms that are due. So let's see. Let's see. I'm going to jokingly put this co company leaves sticker down. Let's see. Because this is supposed to be when Brad gets out of our house. I really hope so. I don't know if it's going to happen or not, but we will see how it goes. I'm ready for it to happen. Okay. Um, I don't really have a... I'm going to put it here. For me to fill out his um, field trip form and all of that. And so I think that that is pretty much it as far as what I know. Um, let me see. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Oh, on Tuesday I have an interview. So I'm going to use this work meeting sticker except for it's not a work meeting because I don't work yet, but I have an interview. I actually did not get that other job. Um, they hired somebody with years and years experience from out of state, so I'm not upset about it. I'm, I'm not. It's totally understandable and fine. I am not upset about it, but that is what happened with that, so at least I heard from it. Um, I am going to put this Make Things Happen sticker down, and I'm going to put it down for Wednesday, I think, because that is, oh, that just scared me. That is usually his off day, but it's not this week, and I need to get some stuff done. Like, I really, really do. I need to get some stuff done. Okay, so other than that, I think that that's all I know. I probably will have to fill in some more things with some more stickers as we go along. But for now, that's what we've got going on. We've already went to the store, so I don't have to go to the store. I am going to put these stickers down because I don't have any um, weekend, like I don't have any day cover-ups for this week. And I hate that I'm covering that part of that up. You can hold on just a minute, okay? Don't eat the cookie. You need to eat all of your pizza before. 
Okay. Well, you can get one for you and one for your brother and then put them back on the counter. Okay. I hate that I'm covering up this washi because I love it so much. And I really do hate that. So I'm thinking, what if I do this instead and just cut the tops off? Because at least I'll be leaving some of it on there. And I think that's what I'm going to do instead. Which, it's still covering it up. But it's showing a little bit of it. And you can kind of tell what's going on. So I need to watch Hocus Pocus because I haven't watched it yet. And it did come on and I recorded it. And I missed Halloween Town and I looked it up to see if it was coming on again. And it's totally not. So that really bums me out because I missed that one. That is so sad to me. I love Halloween Town. I love the first one and the second one, but the first one is the best. If you've never seen them, they are very juvenile Halloween movies and I love them a lot. <laughs> they're really fun to watch I just I don't know I just love them I've loved them since I was a kid and they're just really fun so I watch them every year it's just like those holiday movies you know you have ones that you love for Christmas that you watch all the time and ones that you love for other things so that is how it turned out thank you guys so much for watching I hope that you have a great week and I'll see you guys in the next video bye guys